What is going on, everybody? I've been getting a lot of comments telling me that we are having issues with our extension. So I am going to show you guys a new extension that does basically the same thing. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to Google and we are going to type in bulk Instagram extension. We're then going to come down and use Pandro Instagram DM bot. I'm going to click on that. And we are going to add it to Chrome. Now, as you can see, the layout is pretty similar to the last one, and it should be basically the same platform, just with a new name. So here we go. There we are. <clears throat> So as you can see, I have clicked on Pando Insta DM. It has now logged me or opened up a new tab for me to log into Instagram. Let's see, I think one of these will work. And like I said before, do not use your main account when doing this. There is a good chance that you could get banned or account deleted or anything. So I would just advise you to open up a new Instagram account. It's pretty simple, pretty easy. Just make a new Gmail and just use, I have probably three different bots, let's just say, but they're really just dead Instagram accounts that I could care less if they got deleted or not, because I'd just make a new one. So there we go. We are now logged in, as you can see. So now we're going to go back to Pandro. And as you can see, it has now opened up our platform here in order to send our message. So just like last time, we are going to make sure we download our usernames. We are going to use uh, our Notepad++ in order to get the commas behind them. All of that, um, pretty straightforward. So basically, you can go here, and we are going to put our usernames here. Just like last time, I'm just going to use a simple um, dead account. Let's see. Can't remember what it is. I think it was this. Let's just do that. Hold on one sec. I'll get the right. I'll get the right username. underscore there we go we can also import usernames and stuff like that we're gonna save our recipient so there we go we can also have you know up to 200 of these it's all good so as you can see seen replied is it in a group status let's keep going so now we're going to compose and send our message as you can see we have some great stuff already put in here these are going to give us multiple very variables of what it's going to say this is another way so you do not get caught that easily and there's some more things you can check out Oh, I thought that was already there. Well, we'll just do it simple. You can do this, and you can do one of these, you can do that, you can do that, and you can do that, and then we're going to do one of those. Fantastic. And send it out. So as you can see, now it is pending. It is queued.
and it is sent. There you go. Simple as that. Let me know if you have any other questions. What is going on, everybody? We have another quality extension that can be used to help grow your Instagram. Let's begin. So we're going to go to our Google and type in Everliker. It's going to be this first one here. And remember, we are always dealing with Chrome extensions. Don't be downloading things from weird websites. As a disclaimer, I always say, do not do this with your main account. There is a good chance that you will get blocked, deleted, caught, whatever you want to say. Just start a new account, use a dead account, make it happen. So there we go. We are adding our extension to Chrome. And as you can see, it's pretty straightforward. We're going to get here. We're going to open it up. Looks like we need to be on Instagram. So go ahead and log into Instagram. We're going to turn on our ever liker. We are going to scan tags. We can scan IDs. Tags of Fortnite. Everybody likes those. We want it. What are we going to do? We're going to like the photo. We can also view the story. I'm not interested in doing that. So here we go, plus or minus 20%. So pause for two minutes will be fine. Scan photos posted in the last. We don't want anything old. So let's zoom this up to literally one month old. And we will go to next tag after 120 minutes or 200 likes. Let's begin. If you're wondering what keeps popping up on my screen, feel free to look at my other videos. And there you go. as many as you want. You want your name out there. You want to be liking certain things. You can refine your uh, hashtag down to a very specific one that probably only will have five or 600 recent posts in the past month. And that way you can hit every single one. As you can see, there's 50 million posts under the hashtag Fortnite. So I would definitely advise to refine down your hashtag into something more suitable that would be a more niche market. But there you go. Another great and useful one. Feel free to uh, comment. Go ahead and hit that like and subscribe button. I appreciate you guys. We'll see you next time. What is going on, everybody? So I have come across something pretty cool. I think you guys would like it. So if you're ever wondering how to download somebody's Instagram profile, you can get all of their posts, the hashtags they use, basically everything you need off one specific person. So let's just say, you know, you're looking at a famous person, a celebrity's profile, and you were wondering what, you know, if you could download the, the pictures or videos that they posted, this is how you can. So we're going to go into Google and type in Instagram profile downloader big ban. And it's going to be this first one here. We're going to click on it.
And it's pretty straightforward. So basically, you know, it says you could follow Kylie Jenner here. I'm just going to put in one of my accounts because I know that there's not going to be like a thousand posts or anything. But either way, this is just one of my accounts. We're going to click download here. And it may take up to a few seconds. There we go. Don't know why it didn't work the first few times. But so this is literally one of my accounts. And here's all of my posts that I have ever posted. I think it's crazy. Um, you can literally come here and we can just download whatever we want. Let's download this. Of course, they're going to hit you with the ads. No worries. And there you go. Save now as a JPEG. Moving a little slow. Sorry about that here, folks. Sorry about the slowness, but either way you can get it. This will appear as the post image. So if you want to print off their pictures, if you want to see what other people are posting, if you wanted to actually take someone's, you know, image that they posted, come in and edit it. This is a fantastic way to start creating memes and stuff like that. This is an all around pretty, pretty useful, uh, useful extension. I would definitely advise downloading it. It's a good one. Thanks, guys. What is going on, everybody? I have been getting quite a few comments that is explaining that we're having issues with our extension. Let's get some new ones up and going. So we are going to type into Google Growbot Instagram, and it should be your first, uh, you know, Chrome.Google. It's going to be an extension, so it should look like that. We're going to click right on it. We're then going to add it to Chrome. Add extension. Just take a few seconds. And there we go. So now we're going to click on it. Grow about for Instagram. We're going to click it. And again, it's going to open up Instagram for us because we always need to log into our account. That isn't going to change. But here we go. So, looks a little scary up front. No worries at all. It's pretty straightforward once you can figure out how to navigate through it. So basically what you are going to do is... That's because Instagram's back there. So I'm already logged into Instagram. Then it pulls this up. So let's go here. We're going to search. Let's go to one of my other accounts.
robot again and let's load followers following so let's just load the followers so we can download 50 at a time we can also up that to 100 So we're going to hide this. We are on Young Goat. Open it back up. We want them all. And you can do anything you want. You can load commenters. You can load the likers. Load the following, the followers. And there we go. So now let's take we'll go just username. We can go anything here, followers, load additional data, and there we go. We have everything you need, and as you can see, uh, there is a three-day trial for this, but you can just use infinite accounts. So just keep opening up a new one. It's not gonna. It's not gonna catch you here. Just use a different Gmail, sign into it, and then you can use it however you'd like. So what if we went? And did so let's select them all. And let's add selected to whitelist. There you go, guys. This is one more helpful extension that you can use in order to help build your Instagram, follow more people, get more contact. You can, you know, you can get more data here. We can even get more stuff going on. Followers, following posts. It's a very useful tool. And like I said, don't worry about this three-day thing. Uh, just use a different Gmail. You're good to go.